What is going on guys? Today is the day. Um, we're going to be going to Ryan Pineda's Mastermind in Las Vegas. We're going to get to meet some interesting people, meet some uh, people we can network with, and yeah, I'll see you guys when we're ready. So yeah guys, uh, we're going to Ryan Pineda's uh, Mastermind, like I said. Um, we're really hoping to get the networking aspect out of it. So it should be a lot of fun. Um, we'll uh, let you guys know when we get to the airport and then uh, bring you guys along with my Vegas trip. So we just got to the hotel and uh gotta say this is what you get. Alright guys, so it's day one of the Ryan Pineda Mastermind here in Las Vegas. Uh today's gonna be the office tour. We're gonna go out there, he's gonna give us a tour of it. Anyway, yeah guys, I will hit you guys up when we get there. All right, guys. So we are outside. Uh, we're gonna walk in here and uh, we learn a thing or two, and uh, we'll get some footage. Office on um, the home run offer side. This uh, we used to have feature flipper in here a little bit, but now they are um, going downstairs. But. Uh, this is where the magic happens for what you It goes back to going in the trenches and just learning. By him, it made him that much better of a sales guy, and it makes him that much more appreciative. So, the next hour, I just really want to do Q&A and also talk about um, what you guys took away from that. So. Hey guys, so we are back from day one of Ryan Pineda's Mastermind. Uh, today was the office tour and the Q&A. We shared some knowledge and we got to network with some really smart and uh, crazy investors. So today was a good day, um, it's an early day. Tomorrow is gonna be the seminar and all that. So I will keep you guys tuned, and you guys back tomorrow. All right guys, so today is day two of the uh, Future Flipper Mastermind. Um, today is gonna be like the little seminar portion. Uh, we're gonna go downstairs right now and uh, go check it out. Get some good footage for you, for you guys and uh, yeah, let's go network.
this weekend and then focus on the client stuff. Because Um, yeah, so it's going to be hard to follow Brad Lee. Um, yeah. Truth be told, I still feel a little awkward being up here because I started TikTok, and I'm a big believer in TikTok, the same with the data, because from the start of the pandemic until this point now, I've created a million dollar company, um, doing these stupid TikTok videos for a lot of really big name people. All stars, everybody else? Game time, Ryan's gonna be breaking down how he's done all these deals, how you can do the same. That's why you're here, right? You're here to make money. You're here to do some deals. Do some deals! You're so tall! He's still taller than me and I'm on the stage. I mean... So, uh, obviously everyone in here is first time at this event, so we're happy. You know, my goal for all of you is to not only give you the tools to succeed this weekend and show you exactly how we do it, all the systems, all the processes, the people, everything, but it's also to help you believe in yourself. To be a realtor, how to look at situations through an investor lens so I can make more deals with the same amount. Alright guys, so we are done with day two, Future Flipper Mastermind. We had David Lee go out there and talk, and Ryan Magan, uh, they shed some crazy knowledge and uh, the things they were saying, it was it was insane. We had Brian Davila go out there and talk, and uh, of course Ryan Pineda, uh, like all the people that I've met out here, even people in my own market that I even know. Um, so it's, it's insane. Um, you're surrounded by all these rich and just smart people, and um, just Definitely networking and uh, making these connections. Alright guys, so it is day three of the Ryan Pineda Future Flipper Mastermind. Um, I'm actually running late. Uh, networking started about 30 minutes ago, so I'm on my way down now. Um, yeah, I'll let you guys know how it is. Thank you for breaking this down. I didn't understand it, but now I do. When I walked in this morning, they're like, yo, your speak time's like right after nine. So I walked in here, there was literally nobody here. I was like, oh shit, you guys went too hard last night. Something went down. Guys, we all have a problem. And it's a big fucking problem, okay? And that is that everybody is thinking how to get their next deal. 
talk about today is how we can have exponential growth because that's what I've had in my business and it's really powerful. That's anybody who's been up here that's reached a certain level of wealth, the guy right before me. That was cool. <laughs> What's up guys, how you guys feeling? I'm uh, super excited to be here to talk to you guys today about short-term rentals. It's like what they'll give when they get to your property. Um, the last thing I'll say is just rent it like a hotel. All right, we've all been to a really nice property, a real nice hotel, where you check in, they're friendly, they make you feel like part of the family. When you're talking to your guest person, and he is our next speaker, ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Rob Bills! Make me look better than my editor makes me look. <laughs> He's gonna be a little jealous. How does this thing work? The house that you have, studio apartment. Is there a certain way or any tips you would give someone like me to find places that have studios or you can use in Los Angeles? Um, you usually have to work with your realtor and then have them create an MLS um, list, like you know, a criteria for you that gets emailed out that has certain descriptions in the actual. There's certain keywords in the description. Coming out into our mastermind groups, and this is actually where I think a lot of the value is, because uh, at this point, how much have you guys learned? Like, there's so much information you guys have learned, right? Mm -hmm. Now it's time to start talking about it and how you can implement it and going over who's on the panel. It could be somebody who's just started, who made a lot of progress. It could be somebody who scaled it to a completely different level. But the reason I like doing these is just to highlight the students who are doing that and um, show them some recognition. You know, one of the things, there was like no vision that this would be a thing. It was Shane, it was Davila, um, a few other people who weren't here, Zasha, and to see all of them just a little over two years later to where they're at today is like absolutely insane. I just really want to showcase, you know, these kinds of people that are absolutely crushing it. All a big round of applause. <laughs> Alrighty guys, so that was day number three of the Richard Flipper Mastermind. Um, that is the last day. Tonight we just have the after party. Uh, it's gonna be lit. Yeah, I gotta say, it was an amazing time. I learned a lot, met a lot of great people. A lot. Definitely gonna be coming out to um, to any future events they're gonna be throwing. Alrighty guys, so that was uh, the end of the trip. Uh, I forgot to record the, not the date after the last day. Does that make sense? Anyway, yeah guys, so uh, I went to the after party on the day three, woke up super, super late. Uh, let's just say Future Flipper knows how to throw an after party. But yeah, that was basically it. Yeah, we are back home, finally settled. I'm going to have a, a video up probably next week explaining, you know, my experiences and whether I would recommend someone to go to one of the Future Flipper, mind, uh, Future Flipper Mastermind events. But uh, yeah guys, if you guys enjoyed it, please make sure you leave a thumbs up subscribe button and I'll catch you guys in the next one.